Hey guys, welcome. Hi. Today we're headed into Marshalls to do some retail arbitrage. Join us, let's go. When we come here, we like to go for the clearance sections, especially they're scattered all around the store. <laughs> But uh, we'll find them all and we're going to go and scan for good eBay selfie rates and some good deals. See what we can flip for at least doubling our money. At least. Ooh. This is six, only $16. Valued around 30 And it, oh no, it has stains on it. Oh, well. We don't want that one. It's always good to take an extra close look. We love scanning the toy section, and this is no exception. We can find some good deals for four dollars. This Mighty Morphin Power Rangers little construction set can go for about twenty bucks, and there's two of them. There's one back there, pretty cool. Uh, these Disney Adorables, four dollars a piece. These can go for fifteen to twenty bucks. Well, I think we'll be grabbing those. Here I am in the clearance section of the women's underwear and bras. My favorite place to go. So let's see what's happening here today. Anne Klein briefs. Are you kidding me? Five of them for 10 bucks. I just looked these up on eBay and the last sold listing was these exact set for $29. And they're only asking 10 for all five. Now that's a score. These Juicy Couture thongs are the cutest and I love the lace. I looked them up on eBay. They don't have a great sell through rate, but they do sell and they're going for $29 plus shipping. So I think I might take a chance on these for only 10 bucks. They might sit in the closet for a little bit, but that's okay. Somebody will snatch them up. We absolutely love finding and selling underwear. I mean, and in the clearance section here, there's a lot of guys' underwear, including these t-shirts here. We have these Eddie Bauer tees. They want $8. And it looks like we can get about $30 minus the shipping and fees. So we'll be able to double our money at least. And, oh my gosh, it's like a 50% selfie rate. Also, Spider, a good brand to look out for, at $8. Um, about the same deal. This four pack here, we'll be able to get about, you know, $28 to $30 free shipping. So, good deal there. Last time we were at TJ Maxx, we found this brand. And again, for $8, a lot of these underwear are going for around the same price. This has a really good sell-through rate, too. Here's an example of something with an awesome sell-through rate, nearly 100%, but there's no meat left on the bone. These Foot Joy socks here for $4.50. These go for about $10 a pair. Pretty crazy. Uh, but there's just not enough on the bone here. Bummer. <laughs> One of my favorite places to hang out at besides the underwear aisle when we're out doing retail arbitrage is the pet section. You have heard us talk about this over and over again. Retail arbitrage for animal crunches and toys and chewies. If you do these things at places like commercials, you're gonna save so much money. Oh. That I might find you in the pet <laughs> section. <laughs> There's so much pumpkin stuff here. I just can't get enough. Pumpkin for the pets. Pumpkin for you like peanut butter pumpkin. Okay, so you want to see what I found? Yes, please. It's a surprise. He hasn't seen this yet. Okay. But you know me, I, I always go to the underwear department first. Well, me really? too. That's where I was. <laughs> yeah, I found Dan skins, and these are five pair for ten dollars. Oh. And we love Dan skin. That's a really good brand for us that we sell, and we really love it. Now mm -hmm. these are Nautica. This is a body shaper. Two okay. body shapers, totally awesome, 10 bucks. Sweet. Everybody loves a good body shaper. Nice. Oh, these are Gap, but they're beautiful thongs, really well made. And they were what, originally, I don't even know how much, but these are 12 bucks. So nice. I decided to get them. They're nice. beautiful quality. Cool. And then wait, you see how fun these are? These are so fun, oh my God, okay, wait. Look at these Juicy Couture 
her little thongs. Oh boy. How cute are they, right? I was like, oh my gosh, yes. Originally they were 38 bucks and they were marked down to 10. So oh my gosh. I did my due diligence and I did look these up. Okay. And um, we've got another set of Danskin underpants, 10 bucks. And then finally some Ann Klein, size extra, extra large, 10 bucks. And we always at least double our money with underwears. Oh, no doubt. Nice work, honey, on the underwear. <laughs> underwear up to my eyeballs today. <laughs> I know, right? And same here. Uh, you saw what I picked out as far as underwear. There's yeah. just a few sets here. Yeah. Nothing crazy. A lot of the packages were sort of half open, so we don't want to pick those ones up. But... Oh, I forgot the boy shorts. Oh, Look more. how cute these were. These are only $6. No way. So I think we scoured the entire place of the clearance sections and found just about everything that we're going to be able to flip for a profit here. So let's go see what we paid for all this stuff. After all is said and done, we spent $107.80 on 13 items there. And that's actually about $8 per item. But that's because we got a bunch of underwears and things like that that we're gonna flip for at least $20, $30 practically. Mm -hmm. So uh, actually not so bad of a deal. Well guys, next time you're near a Marshalls or TJ Maxx or something like that, head in there. You might be able to find some deals that you can flip for a profit. If not, you know, we found some dog treats and all that kind of <laughs> things for our puppies and for fruit or some of these. Yeah, yeah, which is always nice too. Mm -hmm. And we always get our stuff on sale, even for ourselves. Right? I mean, we are thrifters <laughs> to the bone. I'm so cheap. <laughs> Let's just be real. Yes, we all are, for sure. <laughs> all right, guys, we'll join us on our next adventure and we'll see you next time. Take guys. it easy, guys. That's up to you. I love seeing limited edition. Pumpkin spice, yay! This is a skin recovery from Paula's Choice, and if you don't know this brand, you have to check it out. I can't believe it. This is, uh, what, double our money? And it is a hydrating treatment mask for dry skin. So. This is a good one to look out for, Paul's choice. For sure, yeah. And a good sell-through rate, too. Yes, good sell-through rate. 